guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Titlar and we are back in Pro Cycling Manager 23, the Pro Cyclist mode and the career of Titlar Hausdauer, who is a Barde slash puncher and his objective is to win the five monuments of cycling, which we've got three of those and as a bonus objective become the KOM winner of the three Grand Tours, which we already succeeded and becoming world champion Euro champion and German champion and we've did it we've done it the world and the German champion lefting the the Euros champion to try in this season because this is the last season of this series but in this episode we are not going to attain any of our objectives because we are heading to Mallorca Spain Vuelta Ciclista Mallorca five stage tour we are I'm going to bring you the entire tour in this episode starting with this first stage which is a very flat one 170 kilometers of flat so i'll bring you the final 20 kilometers the same here for the second stage 180 kilometers final 20 kilometers as well that i'll bring to you and then stage number three exactly the same the final 20 kilometers despite this being considered a medium mountain stage and ending on a hilltop i'm going to bring you the final 20 kilometers of it and the next one, the fourth one, is the one that I'll bring you the full stage, 167 kilometers of very undulating terrain. So I'm going to bring you the full stage here, and finally ending on a flat stage that I'll bring you the final kilometers. So let's get this started, and let's start of course with the first stage, Santani to Campos, and who we got here? We've got Ayuso, who is a better sprinter than us. And probably one of the favorites here in this tour. Hmm, but let's see the favorites. We are not among the favorites. Ayuso is. That's interesting. Ayuso alongside some pure sprinters. So, not expecting to have any teammates here. We've got 87% fitness only. So, probably all the team is going to work for Ayuso. But we'll see. For now. I'm going to do a cut here in the loading and I'll see you guys in the final 20 kilometers to the line. And here we are in the second stage race preview. I forgot to press record on the OBS. So, first stage, we didn't have any team here to work for us. We are the defending title. Oh, the defending champion. Never saw that. So, let's see if we can defend our title. In the first stage, we ended up in fourth with no team. So we tried to follow Pedersen, and we did even better than him. Uh, ending up in 4th, which means general-wise we are in 8th. 16 seconds from jo Jordi Garrido. Points-wise we are 5th. Mountain, we don't care. Young Riders, we don't care. Team-wise, we don't care. So let's go to the second stage. Another flat stage, 181 kilometers. And I'm going to bring you the final 20 kilometers of it. So I'm going to do a cut and I'll see you in the final 20 kilometers. Final 20k to this second stage. And this time around, I did remember to put, to press record on the OBS. So here we are in the second stage, final 20 kilometers. And despite not having the entire team for almost all the race, now the manager decided to give three guys here. To help us so we can try to do a sprint train heading to this last hill which line. is the mountain sprint 2 yes very well known mountain here in Mallorca in this Spanish island and let's see 85 I think it's going to be enough more than enough the breakaway I is almost gone but still with reach. 1 minute and 26 and increasing now one minute, one minute and 30, 40 fallen. even. So it's going to be tough to catch those guys. Clear, more of them are left in the wake. Oh, okay. No more guys uh, available for us because I usually decide to, to give some orders and no more guys here to work for us, unfortunately. I did manage to snatch this guy in the middle of the stage who, who is grabbing who was grabbing water and lock him to protect us at least so we got a protector for the most part of the stage 9 kilometers to go 
the breakaway is going to be very tough to, to get. This is a downhill. They are working hard for it. Garrido with a yellow jersey here. Artega, where are the sprinters? Only five kilometers left. I don't see the sprinters. Tulet. Where are the goddamn sprinters? I saw Molano here, but Molano is completely alone. Okay, that's interesting. Five kilometers gel to me. We have more than enough energies to try to tr take this from the front, to be honest. So let's try to do it. Because I don't see any sprinters available here. Three kilometers, let's use this. I still don't see any sprinters. Oh, I see wall walls here. Let's follow walls. Are we following walls? We are. Good. But we are not getting those guys up ahead. Which is most unfortunate. Let's sprint. Those guys are finishing already. We are sprinting. Sprinting. Still sprinting. Ayuso is going to take this from us. At least the fourth place. Yeah, I use it with the fort. Ourselves with seven only. Yeah, but that breakaway not being caught was bad. Very bad. Okay. So this is interesting. This has been very interesting. Vota Ciclista Mallorca. We are the defending reigning champion. But it's going to be very hard to do something here. Because this has been quite interesting interesting with the breakaways getting a lot of leeway so 42 seconds that we came behind the three men on the breakaway which means yeah those three men are ahead we dropped to ninth points wise we dropped to six mountain wise we don't care young riders we don't care and team we don't talk about the team okay so let's head off to the third stage Three out of five. Okay, this is a hilly one, ending on a hill. But, yeah, why not? I'm going to bring you the entire stage or not? Let me just check here. Yeah, why not? I'm going to bring you the third and the fourth stage. So, yeah, this one I'll bring you the entire stage. Juan Ayuso is the main favorite here. So, again, not expecting to have any teammates here surrounding us. But we'll see. For now, I'm going to do a cut here in the loading, and I'll see you guys in the full race. And here we are in the beginning of this third stage, and yeah, as expected, we don't have any teammates surrounding us. But we didn't get all unlucky here because we've got a zero, so zero doesn't impact any of our stats whatsoever, nor negative, nor positive. So, our main stats, base stats are very good, so it's Attack! not it's that bad. To show the team okay, let's put this at times 8. Let's take the orders of Ayuso out of the way so I can see if we are managing to hold here in the pack. 59, 8 men going into the breakaway, so again, it's going to be tough to deal with the breakaway. We can take a look at the parkour real quick. As we can see, it's very, very undulating terrain. Very harsh, very harsh, and especially that second category. Oh, the Puig Major. Oh, or Puig Mayor. If I say that in Spanish. And yeah, it's going to be very, 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 very hard. Let's keep going. Times eight, please. Let's save some energy. Well, this team is indecided if Vovk or Ayuzu is the leader. I would bet on Ayuzu, to be honest. Or myself. We are dropping a lot. 
on this third category, we can put ourselves to 65 at least, and get into that downhill, and hopefully we can get back up front. So let's use this, let's hope we can get back up front. Almost, almost, almost in the front. Okay, 65 should be good enough to get us to the Puig Mayor base there with no real issues. Okay, so let's put ourselves 85 for this Puig Mayor and let's use this even to help us a little bit. And we should be quite comfortably passing through this. Still 10 kilometers to go and our energy is melting away as we can see. 5 kilometers still and we are almost out of energy. Uh, hold, Hauschdauer, hold. Yeah, we can relax. I will try to relax. Fortunately, Swerbull the guy that is working is out of energy as well, so probably we can hold in this final kilometer, hopefully. Hopefully we can do that. Uh, it's been very tough, place. let's drop we'll ourselves to 65. Should be doable. And try to recover some energy. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, ooh, that last hill, very short, very steep, it's going to be hard, but I think we can do that. We have the ability to do so, we have the hill stats, we've got the sprint stats, and the resistance and stamina stats to do that, I think. Okay, let's use this for one final time, on this flatter bit. And let's keep pushing until we reach... Almost the the base Whoa, of the hill. It's going to be road. tough again to get those guys up there. The breakaway. The pack is trying. The pack is trying indeed. We are keeping ourselves at 65 for the, the time being, at least. Let's put ourselves now 85. Okay. And let's speed this until we get to the base of the mountain here. Mountain. Hill. Okay, we can go, go this. 85 dot. And he moves on to the attack. It could be we decisive. can even go this and go 90 now. The lead over the Final 3 kilometers. The we should be able to do this at 90 all the way. Yes, I don't care, Ayuso. Yes, yes, we are now in the lead. Good, let's try to secure ourselves here in the lead and try to get that break away. Come on, come on, hold, 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 and sprint. Come on, Hoshtower, sprint. He's celebrating the way too soon. The pack gave them no we don't have any energies. Tulet is the winner, Ayuso will be second. Yes, power. and we are going to be fifth. Yes, fifth. Okay. Not the best, but not the worst. <sighs> so we kept ourselves with the best. But we failed to get some bonus seconds or, or something in order to pull away from the main guys. Oof, this is tough, man. He celebrated way too soon, this guy. <laughs> way too soon. And he was caught right at the end. So, general-wise, we are now 8th. So we got one position, but 54 seconds behind. This, this guy that went into the breakaway held, and this guy held as well. So, yeah, it's going to be tough. Points-wise, I use this first. We are in 3rd. Mountain-wise, we don't care. Young Riders, we definitely don't care. And team-wise, we don't talk about the team. So, let's head to the fourth stage, the big one, the queen stage of this Vuelta 
Ciclista a Mallorca. And this one I'll bring you the entire stage again. So 168 kilometers. Juan Ayuso again, one of the favorites. Let's see what we can do. And I'm going to do a cut here in the loading. And I'll see you guys in the full race. Hello and welcome. And here we are in the penultimate stage of this Vuelta Ciclista Mallorca, the fourth one. And again, we are alone. And again, with a zero race day condition. So no penalties, no uh, bonus. But it's better to have no penalties or bonus than to have penalties, to be honest. So not too unhappy with that. And let's speed this up. This is a very far worse stage than the last one and we didn't manage to keep our green bar intact or at least our max potential bars with the yellow and the red intact at the end of the last race so probably it's going to happen the same thing here because this parkour is tremendously ha hard 13 men up there which is worrisome to be honest that's a big, big breakaway on such a hard parkour. Look at this. Look at this parkour. This parkour is not <coughs> something to snuff about. This second category, the call Donor, it's very hard. Oof, the other one, the second, called the Sa Battaglia, heading to the Puig Mayor again. So we are riding the Puig Mayor from the other side this time, okay. And the call, the Belleda, at the end, it's going to prove prove very essential. To be, to be fair, probably it's going to be decisive. Can we hold here in this final kilometer using 59 only? We did. Let's use this to get into the front, hopefully. No, we didn't get into the front. Heading, ooh, this fourth category, called the Grau. It's very hard, so let's go 75. Because this is way harder than I was expecting for a fourth category. The has Short, but speed. very, very steep. There's an attack in the group at the front. So we can drop now to 65. And we can drop now to 59. Good. Should be able to get back up front. We are having some issues to do that, but almost there. Okay, now we can go 65, still 13 men up there, of course. The time is maintaining, but dropping a little bit. Now here we have to go 75 on this harsher part of the climb, the called Donor. <coughs> they really are moving. And even the at 75 we are dropping far. a little bit, so we have to keep up. 75. Let's use this to get back up front if we can. He crashed off Let's and use he's this. Up. Oh, I hope it isn't as too much serious. as possible. This little bump, which is very hard. We've traversed it. He's just pulled off but his we've number. dropped. That's it for him. Let's hope these guys can get back to the pack. Yes, they did. Good. So let's try to get back up front. Yeah, we know, we know. We are trying to save energy, man. Okay, at 70, 65 should be enough to do this, hopefully. Despite this hill being paced so hard that we are struggling a lot to get through this hill at 65. But we've managed to do it. Now this flatter section should be good for us. And now... Let's go 85. We cannot try to conserve energy no more. <coughs> Ayuzu with a very good green bar because of his plus two. So Ayuzu is definitely one of the favorites today. For sure. And let's see if we can keep this rhythm for much longer. Some guys are attacking. Maz. Maz is attacking. That's not good. There's the breakaway a in the meanwhile has split themselves up. 
And Ayuso is working. Okay. Because Vovk, for, for, for some reason, is the leader now. And Ayuso grabbed those guys. And now Ayuso is gone. Because he's still pulling. Okay. That's interesting. We cannot drop from the 85 for the time being. Okay, let's speed this up. The breakaway still with There's one, almost two minutes, 140 on ahead. Oof, but they are all over the place. Of course, this is so hard. We are already dropping our poten max potential bars. I use, on the other hand, is holding nicely. But Vov, who is the current leader, is even worse than us. I'm going to save that. Speed. Aerodynamic skill for the end, Those and uh, Ayuso is attacking now. Attack. Of course, we are not going to do anything to fetch Ayuso. We are only trying to keep ourselves here. Parra is working to get Ayuso. Ayuso is caught. Three men still ahead. Here goes the Swiss man again. We tool it. Tool it the is a danger. Is a bit too docile for some riders who are looking to create the tool it is away. working. Okay. This is interesting. The leaders are working already. And the breakaway is gone. Okay. Ayuso is trying one more time. To go. Breakaway. And no response. So let's drop ourselves to 65 and try to recover something on this downhill. Let's speed this downhill up. I use it still ahead, but losing time. Now he's been caught. Only 15 kilometers left. 15 kilometers left, indeed. And now, hopefully, is our time to shine. If we can attack on that uphill, we'll see if we can. We recovered everything that we lost, at least. Okay, the let's put ourselves 85. The riders just passed the 10 kilometers road sign. Yes, we have. And let's go... Dot. Heading to... The climb. And here we are in the climb. Good. Three kilometers to go. We are pushing hard. Pushing way harder than I was expecting. Let's try to keep ourselves 85. Try not to lose anything here. Final kilometer. Let's get this corner up. Okay, let's use this and let's go 99. Can we do this? Can we attack? The finish line is getting close. The riders just passed the We are attacking on the downhill, but we are not Driver getting away. An inch. Okay, let's follow Ayuso then. Let's drop back to Ayuso. We can even use this and fall back to Ayuso once again. They can go flat out to the finishing line at the bottom, but they've got to watch their trajectory on the way down. Okay, recover. Okay, Ayuso is attacking. Let's follow him. Try to. Much too high for many riders. And off he goes. He's giving it one last go. Ayuso is trying and he has energy to do this. We are following him. We don't have any energy, but we are going to win in second. Ayuso first, well, ourselves second. It was very and well I think deserved. we've got some time the on the other guys. And of course the bonus seconds. So Ayuso will win this tour taking the title from us but our second place is putting us in top five at least if not in the podium hopefully of course Ben Tulet didn't lose too much time so we'll see probably those former breakaway guys that managed to hold in the last stage won't get any hope today I don't think they managed to hold but we'll see I use with a very good 
lead out there and not lead out but with very good attack that nobody could answer not even us okay good results page maybe because that we try to attack there and we shouldn't we should have kept ourselves in the wheel of Ayuso yeah he gained nine seconds to us and uh, ourselves gained 10 seconds to Jorgensen and David Fernandes and even more to Ben Tullet. meaning we are second okay okay so our team must now be first I think points wise Ayuso is taking home this mountain wise we don't care Young Riders definitely don't, don't care. And yeah, team-wise we are ahead with 4 minutes to the second one. So we'll get 3 jerseys, both to Ayuso and then the team jersey. Both, no, f uh, the classification and the points to Ayuso and the team to ourselves and the rest of the gang of our team. Heading to the last one, 168 kilometers almost. V flat with that hill here at the middle of the, or the first first part of the last third of the race the call de Grau and Ayuso yeah one of the favorites we are not of course so this one I'll bring you the final 20 kilometers so I'll do a cut here in the loading and I'll see you guys in the final 20 kilometers to the line last 20 kilometers of this fifth stage of the Vuelta Ciclista Mallorca and the last 20 kilometers of today's episode as well and if we want to try to do something here and still winning this tour uh, it's going to be very hard to do so but we must try at first getting that break away and then trying to do something the the on the hill the there so let's speed through it yeah, the breakaway is almost gone. Almost, almost gone. I use it, is in my wheel, which is not something we want to see, to be honest. Okay. So let's set ourselves here at 85 dot because the breakaway is almost done for. Yes, indeed. We are in the lead. Five kilometers gel to me. Okay, now let's try to do an attack here. Let's see if we can do that. Yes, we are off. It's not a strong attack, but we are off. Okay, let's drop this and let's go. Not 85, but probably 90 with the aerodynamic skill. And let's hope that's enough to keep us ahead of the peloton. We are trying. We are trying. 10 seconds ahead. I think we attack at the right spot. 17 seconds. 16 seconds. Sprint. We've get, we got this win, but th it's that enough to... This win is give well us the amount of tenacity. time needed for winning this tour I don't think so I also didn't manage to did not manage to get the bonus seconds so at least 10 seconds we got but we needed an extra nine I think to win this and I think we've got six if the game will acknowledge those six seconds but we'll see and this was a very good attack on the right spot. We did very well, it was on our only chance to try to do something here. And let's see what's the outcome. And here it is, Tritlar Hausdauer completely alone. With the bunch print happening behind him. Yes, what a victory here to Tritlar Hausdauer. Good. And let's see what's the verdict. No no seconds of gap and fortunately so we ended up in second yeah nine seconds behind Juan Ayuso congrats to him points wise we've managed to grab that jersey at least cool 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 so Juan Ayuso take the general classification jersey we take home the points jersey mountain we don't care young riders we definitely don't care and team wise we ended up winning the whole thing good 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 very good. 
So, this was the, <coughs> the last race of the day. Next time around, we are still keeping ourselves in Spain and we are heading to Valencia. And yeah, we are going to race this Valencia tour for sure. It's another five stage tour. And the first is a prologue, no, a time trial. So we'll follow Hausdauer on his time trial. Then the second stage, the big one, or one of the big ones here of the Valen in the Valencia tour, Vuelta a Valenciana, sorry. And I'm going to bring you the entire stage. The third one, a flat one, the final kilometers. The fourth one, another big one. I'm going to bring you the entire stage as well, where Hausdauer has a very good shot there. And that last hill, ending on a downhill. And finally, the last one, another flat stage that will bring you the final kilometers. So that's the plan for the next episode, because this one is done. And I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, and leave me some comments down below. Thanks so much for watching. My name is Titlar. I hope to see you next time for the Vuelta a Valenciana. Bye bye and take care. If you liked this video, please like and subscribe. Also, read the description below where you will find ton of useful information and links regarding the contents of this video.